All right, everybody. Hey. This is exciting. Uh, this is the Almost Millennials React YouTube channel, and we are here with what I'm sure some of you have already seen, or all of you have seen, but we don't care. This yes. is Avengers 4 Endgame. I am so hyped up for this. It's ridiculous. You're hyped? Um, extra hype. I, I'm so excited. The last Avengers was a ball breaker. It really was. A lot of people didn't see it coming. Us who have read the comics and everything else, yeah, we know what's going on for some of it. They they're changing things up. There's mm -hmm. stuff that's not, really you know, in there. Or... Yeah, and and they're gonna do that. They do that with all of their movies. So. <laughs> Let's let's get ready for this. We don't need too much of an intro. Yeah, this is this is just going to be a, a great movie. Dance break. I'm excited. Are you ready? I am so ready. I've been ready. I'm so excited to see Thanos. I'm so excited. I want to see what happens to him. Hmm. All right, here we go. Come on, Barney. So we got Iron Man. If you find this recording, right, don't feel bad about this. Part of the journey is the end. It's a beautiful picture. Just for the record, being adrift in space with zero promise of rescue is more fun than it sounds. Food and water ran out four days ago. Oxygen will run out tomorrow morning. Is this how he goes? Hey, man. You know? You never know. When I drift off, I will dream about you. Oh, you. Pepper, Pepper, right there. I'm here for you, baby. <laughs> Gotta get in the feels. Ooh. Goosebumps. I, I <laughs> yeah. Um, I just want Ant Man. Where the hell? Mm, sorry. Where was he? It's, we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out everything. I. That I'm is a very so, good question. I'm so happy that this trailer made me feel that way. Yeah. I got goosebumps. That was awesome. I. In, towards the beginning, seeing uh, Thanos, he hung his armor up as a scarecrow in his field. That that right there immediately made my hair just do this. Because what that is, is he's, to me, I think he's now at peace. Yeah. Is that he, he, he believes he's done the right thing. Mm -hmm. And that's him kind of hanging up his armor and saying, you know, I'm done. My journey is over. Yeah. You know, my, the ring is at Mordor. You know what I mean? Like he, he feels like I, I, I did I, my conquest. This is it. He he but, feels that not only did what he do probably was, I mean it was a horrible act. It was a horrible thing, of course. And he's not gonna get what he wants. I'm just but no, that's but to him it's he's saved everyone else again and again and again. I always repeat this. To every villain, they're a hero in their own story. Yeah. Okay. 
And Thanos right now, seeing his armor up, he feels like he did the greater good and he is the hero. That's what but he thinks. Why his we, perspective. That, I, I'm happy that you know he, he went through his conquest and everything and he did what he said he was going to do. But why would we just leave the armor just hitting out just like that? Why would we just sit? Because he feels like he doesn't need it anymore. So what if somebody else goes touch that stuff? That he's Thanos, he'll figure it out. All right. He's one of the he's one of the strongest beings. Probably not. He's one of. He's one of. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's one of. I mean, if you read the comics, now you know who can beat yeah, him yeah, and yeah. all of that. Which I'm not going to get into yeah, that because I, I don't that. I don't yeah. want to screw that up for yeah. people. But there's a I, there's a special part that I put aside for yeah, the sauce villains. Part for Thanos. Yeah, for a lot of villains. Yeah, because I guess they have their own side. And yeah. Why they got to that point. There, there's a I mean, uh, everything, every time you see a kid walking down the street and they've got a Spider-Man backpack or, you know, whatever it is, and it's all one of the heroes, you're typically not seeing anybody go in with a villain's backpack. No. Or, you know, a villain's trapper keeper or whatever no, it is. No, And because, you know, people would think, oh, well, maybe, you know, that person is a little creepy. Maybe they shouldn't be... You know, aligning themselves, whatever with, this villain yeah. character is. But if you really get down into some of the comics um, and some of the movies too, is that they're trying to show that they, yes, they're a villain, but they they also have a side to them that isn't straight villain. Yeah, because look, at the end of the day, everybody has family, right? Yeah, everybody wants to eat. Everybody is everybody has a daughter or a son, son to or someone, somebody, and. So. You know, so I, I like to to play that perspective and that devil's advocate and kind okay. of understand where they're coming from. And Thanos is a character where I understand where he's coming from. He, he thinks that he can fix the universe. He can fix it, but guess what? You ain't getting it. You, you ain't getting what you're looking for. Well, we'll see. We don't know. We haven't watched it yet. You know who he's in love with, right? It doesn't matter. Right. It doesn't matter. You know? I, you're never going to get it. I'm excited it. for this. It comes out in April. Yes. And... As we I, we've talked in the past before, you know, there's movies that we don't see in theater, mm -hmm. and we just want to watch them at home. Yeah, I know a lot of people. It's probably sacrilege that I am not going to see this in the theater. You're I'm not. Wait. I'm going to wait, okay. and I'm going to watch it at home when it's released by myself. So that and you can just so I can really kind of yeah. grasp and understand what's going on. I don't want. You know, a kid crying off that way, somebody else, you know, dropping their Mike and Ikes and, <laughs> you know, popcorn and, you know, whatever sure. else. In the comfort of your own home, you, you can pause yeah, it and go I, to the bathroom and come back. Well, it's not even that. I want to be able to really watch without distraction. Okay, and, I understand that. Um, you know, this is one of those films where I feel like that's what I have to do. So luckily, my local comic book store doesn't allow you to speak about these movies. And they have signs on the door, as we spoke about in one of our last videos. And so I feel okay not watching it. Yeah. All right. Well, so I will spend my money and I'll wait until it comes on. I'll do both. Well, just don't tell me what happens when you go to the theater and watch it. I'll but everybody, uh, I mean, comment, let us know what you think. Um, let us know. If, I mean, with Thanos hanging his armor up, do you think that means something else completely different? And maybe I'm off track. Um, but that scene, and then with him just kind of running his hand through his crops in the field. He's being carefree now. Just letting it go. Letting it's awesome. Loose, letting his hair it's loose. awesome. I like it. You know, and then, you know, it shows that Ant-Man, I assume, is going to be a large part of this That's movie. That's why I want to know, because that man should have been... But see, I'm not a huge Ant-Man fan. Bro, he's... I'm just not. He's awesome. And he's smart. Watch Ant-Man and the Wasp. Have you seen it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, the fact that you don't even remember if you've seen <laughs> that movie tells you. No, I didn't think. Why? Yeah, I know you had to. Because he's in a lot. He's in. He's in the Ask movie. me if I've seen Ant Man and the Wasp. Have you seen Ant Man and the Wasp? Yes. Didn't have to think that long. Ask me if I've seen Thor. Have you seen Thor? I have. Okay. <laughs> if you have to think that hard, if you've seen a movie, it was not memorable, and maybe they should work on their characters a little bit. So, mm. we'll see what happens. I'm just not an Ant-Man fan, but that's me. That's everybody has that's, a cup of tea. That's it's me. Right. Everybody's got a different thing that they're into. But Either way, this movie's going to be good. It's gonna I'm be really long. looking forward to it. Please, so, subscribe. Yeah, we'll, what we'll do is we'll put a video up after we uh, we watch it. 
mm-hmm. and we'll and just do, we'll do a wrap up. Yeah. I think for a movie like this, we, we need to do, do a wrap yeah. up, and so we'll go ahead. We'll do that. Uh, we'll get that out in April, and uh, yeah, just comment, subscribe, like, do all those good things. Uh, st- stick around with us. We've got a lot of different content coming out. No and, um, If there's if there's anything else that right. um, you think we should watch. Let us know. Send it in the comments, and we'll check it out. So, from the Almost Millennials, take care of yourself. Go Thanos.